day after day, and the sun and the wind and the rain. The documentary titled Jane starts in 1960, when Jane Goodall was 26 years old. Through interviews with Goodall and National Geographic footage, the film documents Goodall's early years as a woman with no university degree working in a remote part of Tanzania. Her unconventional ways of observing these chimps challenged the scientific community's belief on what it means to be human. Well, more than any other documentary that's been made, it does take me back into the actual feeling I had when I was out there in the forest. And so it's very moving. Goodall says the music composed by Philip Glass made watching the documentary a magical experience for her. For Glass, there was one moment in the film that especially moved him. The, the very intimate scenes when she's sitting with them and, and they're like children to her. She's, she's combing their hair and she talks with them and they're, they're just with her as if they've accepted her totally. With that acceptance, Goodall made headlines by discovering that chimpanzees are intelligent social animals who use tools to gather food something the scientific community at the time believed only humans could do. Everything worked out perfectly. And were mistakes made? Of course. But one learns from mistakes. And so I wouldn't have changed anything, really. Goodall remembers her unique relationship with the chimps. It's not quite family, but it's not quite like friends. But, it, you know, I'm part of their lives. They accept me. I can watch what they do. And of course, in the, the time of the movie, we had a really close, touching relationship, which we don't have anymore. This documentary features the footage of National Geographic filmmaker Hugo van Lauwick, Goodall's first husband. Going through 100 hours of Hugo van Lauwick's footage is a dream. Uh, you know, Hugo's one of the greatest wildlife cinematographers in the history of filmmaking. Hollywood actor Jamie Lee Curtis describes why she is in awe of Goodall. She has has just by doing what she loves, has brought us all along on the journey. And that's a message, if anything, you know, be uncompromising in your vision, uncompromising in your attack and attitude of what it is that you do. I was persuaded. Even in present day, Goodall continues to travel and speak about the need to protect the natural world. Elizabeth Lee, VOA News, Los Angeles. I didn't care what anybody said.